Today, I'm gonna to reward you guys for helping this channel reach an important milestone by revealing a secret about this channel that nobody knows. Let's get undone. What is happening, everybody? I'm Gerald Undone, and today we're celebrating two things. The first is the two-year anniversary of this channel, and the second thing is this channel surpassing 5,000 subscribers. Now, I'm a little bit late on both of these things, but it's not my fault, I swear. I literally had no chance to make the 5,000 subscriber video sort of around the time that it happened, because I was when I was in the planning stage for it, which was around like the 4,500 subscriber point, then the next thing I looked, it was past 5,000 just instantly in like one day. So I didn't even have a chance to make the video. And in the middle of trying to sort out that video and deal with everything like that, the, the two year anniversary kind of passed by too. So today's video is gonna be kind of a combo of both of those, even though now I don't, <laughs> I think we're over like 6,000 subscribers now, which is great. Just means it doesn't really line up with the video. At the rate we're gaining subscribers, by the time I finish recording this video, I'm gonna have to do some alternate dialogue to sort of dub in over the amount of subscribers that we get. It'd be like, Thank you guys so much for helping me reach 43,000 subscribers. But no, as of right now, the number is 6,211. And that's crazy, I'm really happy about that. And I think the last couple of videos have a lot to do with that. So thank you so much to all the new subscribers that we recently gained. Who knew how much you guys would like me showing you things with plain white text effects morphing across the screen? That's great though, because I like making those kinds of videos. And I like to think I'm a bit of an expert on what kind of videos I like to make, because in the last two years on YouTube, I've done quite a few different things. In fact, reaching 5,000 subscribers over two years isn't particularly impressive in its own right, but I blame that sort of slow growth in the beginning on my protracted development period to figure out what kind of videos I should be making. Yet what's even sillier is I actually started my channel making this kind of content before I veered off to do other things and then eventually come back to it. Mind you, they weren't quite as good of quality when I started out. Who could benefit from maybe just a little bit of information involving how to light their shots a little bit better. So I'm gonna start out. But despite those early videos being reasonably successful, I stopped making that kind of content so that I could focus on something much more important. Today I'm gonna to teach you guys how to sharpen your hammer. To help pass the time, I recommend listening to Enya. Who can say where the road goes, where the day flows, only time. I spent over a year on YouTube trying to be successful by making the most absurd, sarcastic, self-parody videos that I could think of. And as much as I love quite a few of those videos for their humor and originality, it's not a real big surprise that that plan failed. And throughout that process, I would continue to make the occasional tech or DIY video that would usually do quite well, but I refused to take the hint. I even went so far as to take on a 10 video per week schedule that involved everything from let's play gaming videos to a freaking cooking show. But you know what, it was a fun ride and I'm not complaining because because as much as it may have set back, you know, my timeline in terms of subscriber growth, I'm really glad that I got to just sort of make whatever content I wanted to make because originally that was the whole point of YouTube in the first place. And there are quite a few of you guys that have actually stuck around throughout this crazy wacky journey that I put you on and I know it must not have been easy. There had to have been times where I was really sort of testing the patience of the type of absurdity that you would endure. There had to be times where you were sitting there watching one of my videos and just being like, what in the sweet hell is this? For my newest form of comedy, Sark Dramedy. But I'm also glad to have found something that seems to be working and is helpful to people because that was another point from the beginning and that's why I end all of my videos with saying that I hope this video was helpful or at least entertaining because that's why I'm making them. I want to give something of value to the internet and I'm not so sure that I was doing that before. Now for those of you that are seeing these clips for the first time, consider that part of my thank you because you won't find these videos anywhere on my channel anymore. I've since cleaned shop, I've made a new playlist and deleted all the old videos that don't really pertain to creative tech anymore to try and focus the channel a little bit more reasonably. And that's the phase of this channel that we're currently on and have been since about February of this year. I like to call this phase, phase six, return of the tech guy. 
Yeah. And I think that that guy is here to stay because the results speak for themselves. But I do think that we'll continue to see the crazy stick its head up from time to time because I just can't help myself. Anyway, that's enough rambling on about that. I just figured since I haven't done an update video in a while, we could kind of put that into the milestone video, a little bit of a story slash update, which would help the new subscribers get a little bit of a synopsis on the background of this channel. And the OG subscribers, well, I hope you enjoyed our walk down memory lane. But what I'm really trying to say is that I am extremely happy about where this channel has gone over the last two years and where it ended up today. And I am very thankful to all the subscribers, new and old, for watching these videos. Thank you for your views, your likes, your comments. It's been a blast engaging with you and growing this channel together. So here's the year three, and the next milestone. Now, I said in the intro to this video that I was gonna reveal a secret about this channel that nobody knows. And I realize that this may shock some of you, but there is something going on here with my studio that I've never told anyone. <sighs> okay, here goes. This whole place is actually black and white. There. <sighs> I said it. Feels good to get that off my chest. I'm sorry for not being open about this until now, but I just couldn't hold it in any longer. But yes, my whole world is black and white. Now I know what you're thinking. This guy has lost his marbles. Clearly the video is in color. And you're right, the video is in color, but it's not because my studio is in color. In fact, it's because I have a very rare and important filter that converts black and white to color. And I'm gonna show you what my world really looks like for the first time right now. All right, here goes. See? It's all black and white. And the filter is doing all the color work. It's a pretty impressive filter, isn't it? It's where I get my signature color grade from. And it even has a dial on it that lets you control the saturation. Anyway, that's my secret reveal. Thanks for letting me get that off my chest. And don't worry about future videos. Just because I told you my secret doesn't mean I'm gonna stop making my videos in color. They'll all still have the signature undone color. In fact, I think we'll all probably feel a little bit more comfortable if I just go ahead and put this back on. There. Anyway, that's gonna be it for me. Thank you so much for the 5,000 subscribers. You guys are amazing. And I hope you found this video entertaining because let's face it, you probably didn't find it helpful. And I'm not gonna ask you to subscribe because chances are you already are. So instead I'll just say, I hope you have a great day. All right, I'm done.